What's up everybody? How is everybody doing today? Today we're going to be talking about the Bible. That's what we do every day. But today we're going to be talking about the Bible specifically. Uh, when was the Bible first published? This is July 16th and that's what we're going to be talking about in today's daily devotionals with me, Tilla. Hi. How are you guys doing today? My name is Tilla. Today is July 16th. Again, we're talking about when was the Bible first published. And we are reading from Pastor Doug Bachelor's uh, 365 Amazing Answers to Big Bible Questions. All right, here we go. When was the Bible first published? The scripture reading is Matthew 24 and verse 35. Heaven and earth will pass away, but my words will by no means pass away. The Bible was first mass printed in the mid-15th century, century when Johann Gutenberg um, invented a new form of movable type that eventually led to the mass production of books. The Gutenberg Bible was published in Mainz, Germany around A.D. 1454. And it was the first major book printed in the West. In the West, <laughs> about 180 copies were made, and significant, significant, significant parts of 48 copies still remain. However, the Bible was preserved and duplicated for many centuries before Gutenberg published it. The books of the Old Testament existed before Jesus was born. As a human, um, excuse me, and both he and his disciples called them the law and the prophets. That's the Old Testament in Luke 16, verse 16. The Jews guarded the Old Testament scriptures so carefully that it is a that if a scribe made a single mistake while making a copy, he had to destroy the entire manuscript by burning it in fire. Of course. What else are they going to use to burn? Um, <laughs> so, where was I? It was a life's work to ensure that every letter uh, was just right. And curses were pronounced on any scribe who dared alter God's word in any way. This careful work paid off. The text of the Dead Sea Scrolls, which existed before the time of Christ, uh, is almost exactly like the versions of the Old Testament we have today. After Jesus died, Mark, Matthew, Luke, and John penned their Gospels and Paul wrote his letters. Many years later, godly men began to assemble all, the, all of the writings from after the time of Christ, which they referred to as the New Testament. By AD 300, all of these books had been compiled to form the Bible that we still use today. The original language of the Old Testament is Hebrew and some Aramaic, whereas the New Testament was written in Greek. The Greek word for the for Bible is Biblia, means books, uh, which accurately describes the collection of 66 sacred texts. Only 66. Nothing else. No other books. Only 66. We'll talk about those other books later on. Um, God moved on the hearts of people who were inspired by the Holy Spirit to write down in human language truths impressed upon them for the purpose of spreading God's message of salvation to others. Today, the Bible is the best-selling book of all time. About 100 million copies are printed each year. It is a book that has truly changed our world. In Psalms says uh, that the word of God is like a light unto our path. The word of God is like a light unto our path. Anyways, that is what we have for today. Today again is July 16th. That's what we have for today. We talked about the Bible and really nothing much that we can say. Um, you guys can search up, search, search this whole thing up in, hist in history. You guys will find out more things about the Bible. One video to recommend, though, is Walt's, Walter Veith's, um Total Onslaught video about the Bible. It's called the 
battle for I think it's called the Battle of the Bibles something like that check it out and you will find out more things about the Bible thank you guys again for stopping by in today's um, daily devotionals again July 16th uh, thank you for stopping by if you guys were blessed by this daily devotional and would like to share it please do share it with your friends your family your coworkers, your relatives anybody who you know would be blessed by this daily devotional uh, please share it uh, you guys are just as much part of this ministry as i am and also my wife over there who's making noises uh, if you guys are um, new to this channel uh, please subscribe um, and also make sure to hit the bell so you guys can get notified every time we upload new videos and also do uh, what do you call those things those uh, live streams um, so please hit the bell so you guys can get notified when we do upload videos and do live streams and if you guys are inspired to um, support this ministry please do so by praying for this online video ministry and also donating schoolforprofits.tv we will take the donations and we will use it to make more Bible study films like From Babylon to America, Prevail, Prevail Part 2, From America to Babylon, which is the Part 2 of From Babylon to America. It's kind of confusing, but we will use the donations for all those and also to advertise these videos so that we can reach more people out there. Thank you guys again for stopping by. Praise God always. And as again, if you guys have more questions, please sign up for our discord link is in the description you guys can ask your questions there i'm there regularly it's like a chat it's a whole family where it's a community really so please sign up for discord please sign up links in the description box just like that thing says right there continue the conversation sfp forum or sfp discord links in description box I had to say it twice because I'm cool. <laughs>